So here we have another question from CAT 2022 slot 2. Working alone, the time taken by Anu, Tanu and Manu to complete any job are in the ratio of 5 is to 8 is to 10. They accept a job which they can finish in 4 days if they all work together for 8 hours a day. However, Anu and Tanu work together for the first 6 days, working 6 hours, 40 minutes per day, then the number of hours that Manu will take to complete the remaining job. Now, as we are discussing about the attitude solution for these questions. So, what are the things to be taken care of? And here it's a non-MCQ, of course, so we do not have any options as well. What can we do here? See, the point is, in aptitude, the first thing that you look for is that the smallest unit of time must be taken in such questions. For example, here he is talking about days. He is also talking about hours per day. So, it's better to move in terms of hours per day rather than days because that is the smallest unit of time. And second thing, avoid any kind of variables. That's the aptitude way. That you just have to avoid any variables, do these questions, thinking of a practical situation and try to solve that way. So, here, Anu, Tanu and Manu, they take, uh, the time taken by them is in a ratio of 5 is to 8 is to 10. So, I can say their efficiencies are in a ratio of 1 by 5 is to 1 by 8 is to 1 by 10. I'm sure all of you know this. The ratio of efficiency is inverse of the time. So, if I just multiply this whole by 40, I can say the ratio of their efficiencies are 4 is to 5 is to, I'm sorry, 8 is to 5 is to 4. That means if Anu can make 8 units in a day, Tanu can make 5 units in a day and Manu can make 4 units in a day. Rather, here, talking about a day, I would say better is talk about an hour. So, if Tanu can make 8 units in an hour, then Tanu can make 5 units in an hour and Manu can make 4 units in an hour. How does it help me? I will tell you that. He says they can finish the job in 4 days working 8 hours per day. That means if they are working 32 hours, is that right? In 4 days when you work 8 hours per day, that means you are doing the job in 32 hours. And all three of them working together are doing it in 32 hours. All three means 8 plus 5 plus 4. That is equal to 17 units. So, I can say the total number of units which are to be made are 544. 17 into 32. 32 is the total number of hours that they work. 17 is the total number of units they are working together. So, therefore, 544 is the total work. Now, he says Anu and Tanu work for... 6 days working 6 hours 40 minutes per day. Now, 6 hours 40 minutes means 6 plus 2 by 3 hours. 40 minutes is 40 by 60 hours. So, it is 20 by 3 hours. And they worked for 6 days. That means they worked for 40 hours. For 40 hours, Anu and Tanu have worked. So, they must have made 13 units every day. So, they have already made 520 units. Total units are 544. 520 have already been made. We are left with just 24 now and these 24 are made by Manu by making 4 every hour. So, Manu is going to take 6 more hours to complete the work and that is the answer to the question. This is an aptitude way of solving the question. Thank you. Mm -hmm.